Hello, boys and girls of the internet, it's Ninjas R Us here, bringing you another exciting episode of Bioshock Infinite. This is a episode 7, so let's get started. We left off last time as we got escaped the tower with Elizabeth. We got to this one area. We grabbed some loot. I told you to make note of some very important things, because it will be important when it comes to the ending of the game. And I also told you that all of the choices have zero impact on the ending, <laughs> like most Bi unlike most Bioshocks, sorry. Unlike most Bioshocks, where, like, some minor choices have a major effect on what ending you will get. No. It's the same ending every time. And to prove that, I took the unobvious choice of the bird or the cage. The bird symbolizes freedom flying. The cage symbolizes imprisonment. Most people would pick the bird because they think, oh, you know, it's freedom. Yay. That's what we're trying to do. I picked the cage to prove them wrong. All right. So let's get started. I'm very hyper. I'm very excited to be doing these again. Did the Latuses go again? Yes, they did. So we just gotta go. Look at that. Okay. Come on, Elizabeth. Now we gotta get to this first lady airship. Apparently, everyone knows about the songbird. They they were just talking about it. Put those arms up now. I will kill you all. Is that guy pointing a gun at his eye? Wow. through there. I never noticed that before. Dimwit and Duke. Okay, I'm guessing the guy pointing the gun at his eye is Dimwit. Just an assumption. <laughs> I did not notice that the first time. No, I'm not going to take his... Actually... To be a douche. Taking the homeless guy's booze. Whoa. <laughs> that is awesome. <laughs> All right, let's get going. Elizabeth. Uh, damn Elizabeth, honey. What are you doing? You're a roguish type. What does it look like? Done. What does that mean, I'm the roughish type? What did you learn to pick locks? Trapped in a tower with nothing but... What is that supposed to mean? Is that a racist <laughs> joke? Surprise. Even though I'm white. Thank you. Thank you, Elizabeth. Thank you so much. Thank you for insulting our race. Saying we are the roughish type? How dare you. Never been more insulted in my life. Okay, let's get going. I must take any task with more than... Oh, hello, sir. Don't you pay me no never mind? Just some foolishness, you know. <laughs> Just monkey shine. Monkey shine? Oh my god! These people are terrible. <laughs> and I know you're probably thinking, oh, you know, he's seen that before. Thanks for the money. You're probably thinking, oh, you know, he's seen that before. No, I never noticed him saying monkey shines. That's a little... It's a little weird. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so I got my stuff. There was a mixed racial couple. Increases clip size. Yes! That's gear, for those of you that don't know. Uh, what gear does is it gives you a little boost. Sort of like a perk. There's a voxophone in there. It's Daisy Fitzroy, the leader of the Vox Populi. When I first seen Columbia, that sky was the brightest, bluest sky that ever was. <laughs> Seemed like heaven. Then your eyes adjusted to the light, and you saw that sea of white faces looking hard back at you. Okay, so here's the mixed racial couple that were, uh, that were getting yelled at. You know, they were getting, like, beat at the, uh, hey, raffle. Hey, but look, colored and Irish washrooms. Like Told ya. Do I know you? Back at the lottery, you... Without you, we wouldn't have gotten away. Daisy always said somebody like you would come along. Why is her... Okay, why is her hand floating? And is that guy Irish? Because that would... No, he has blonde hair and blue eyes, so he's, like, the master race, so-called... Very low on health. Killing enemies give you health. Alright, that's gonna be useful. So, he's supposed to be like the master race, I guess. That's Maybe that was designed to prove, you know, not everyone follows the racist ways. God, these are in, like, terrible conditions. Uh, and Elizabeth won't come in there. You best be on your way, or there's gonna be trouble for us both. Are there any urinals, or do they just make you pee in that? I mean, there's, you know, stalls, of course, but... 
find you here. Find you here for me. All right, so let's go in here. And here's back where the white people are. Yay. <laughs> Sarcastic yay. All right, so we got to go to the first lady airship, but there's probably some good stuff around here. Let's take a look. I, my first playthrough, I, mean, I keep saying my first playthrough. When I beat the game by myself, because this is like a continuation, technically, of my first playthrough, but when I beat the game the first time, I didn't really look around here. Ooh, okay. money. This is why Elizabeth is so helpful. If she finds things, she gives them to you. And also, the coins have a bird in a cage on one side and like the other, so that's cool. So we gotta go that way? No, we don't have to go that way, so I'm going this way. Men's and women's. Let's go to the women's bathroom. Okay, my salts are full. Uh, I'm gonna flush some toilets. Just notice the difference between, you know, the two different kinds of... What? Okay, that's weird. <laughs> these, these have some really cool, like, propaganda posters. Uh, more salts. There's a voxophone in here. Father Comstock left his voxophone in the bathroom. As a boy, I had a dog named Bill. And like all dogs, Bill was a loyal friend. Everything's fine. Bill would have been loyal. If we had struck him, Bill would have been loyal. Only when the colored man can make that claim will he take his place in society. It's one thing, okay, since not reading it, it's one thing to find out you're running around kissing girls, but like little Mary McCarthy and O'Reilly or whatever, it, they're basically saying, this guy is a pimp running around kissing girls. He's kissing Irish girls. She gets angry, even though redheads are extremely attractive. This is another cool thing, sorry to get off topic, but this is another cool thing I noticed about her AI. It's so lifelike, like she doesn't just stand there. She'll sit down, she'll, you know, explore. Be prepared for some racism, folks. Yeah. Okay, I'm done with this. Basically, they say, go work for Fink, which is the guy who ran the raffle. Okay, so it's this way. Hall of Heroes. Do, 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 do. Hello, miss. Annabelle? Excuse me? Annabelle, it's me, Esther. That's also important. No, Annabelle. Remember, Annabelle. Sure? My name is Elizabeth. Do I Annabelle. Remember that association. It will be important. That was odd. Okay. Last customer. Park's closing. Park's closing, everyone. All right, let's go, Elizabeth. These shoes sure could benefit from a shine. Guess I haven't paid much attention. Can I get my shoe shined? Pretty please. That'd be really cool if they let you get your shoes shoe signed. Shoe signed. There we go. I can speak out? again. Excuse All right, remember. Uh, I forgot what I was gonna say. I tell you to remember, um, and I don't remember myself. Setting a great crowd. example here. Scaffolding. Remember, in this game, always take stock of your surroundings. It's very important. Remember, as you'll see right now, not all is as it seems. Two tickets for passage to the First Lady airship. Yeah, just a minute, friend. Yeah, I have it. How do you, uh, want to proceed? In a bit of a rush, pal. Mm-hmm. I got it. I'll ring you back once the matter's in hand. I don't like this. Yeah, send in the bird. We're ready to execute. Excuse me, can I get some help here? Certainly, sir. Sorry about the way- ah! Yeah. What are you doing? Wow, he just stabbed my hand. At least it didn't show, like, the super gra- Oh, yeah, it does. <laughs> when you do it yourself, you either have the choice to shoot him, or, well not shoot him, but draw your weapon, um, or not, and, okay, I'm in a bad position right here, 
but it gives you the option to draw your weapon or to not. I chose not to because that's what I did the first time, and I kind of want to live this as close as possible to how I did it the first time. Oh, that gear just saved my life. That guy's got a shoddy. Okay. Grabbing my machine gun. Spray him down. Spray him down. Spray him down. Okay. I'm taking that shotgun. The shotgun is probably my favorite. Yeah, definitely my favorite weapon in this game. Elizabeth is getting kidnapped. I'm not paying attention to her. Everyone here was trying to kill me. Oh, no, she's not getting kidnapped. She's running away from me because I just killed people. All right. Oh, I wanted to. I wanted to show you what happens when you. Uh... Oop! I heard someone. Oh, there he is. Get on fire! That's another gear I have, and I love it. It sets them on fire 70% of the time when I hit them with that. And when they are on fire, they take like 300 points of health damage per second. It's ridiculous. It's it's great. So remember, there's the infusion over there. I gotta grab that. Um, I'm probably gonna infuse my health this time. Or not my health, my Elizabeth, shield. Where are you? Let me just check out back here. I know they got some good stuff. Oh, there's another Voxophone. It's Esther Mailer. This is the moment we trained for. The false shepherd is here. The day was not exact, but the Prophet's sight proves out again. The specimen must be taken alive. That's good. If she <laughs> dies, I suspect they will give us to the bird. And whatever pieces it leaves behind will bear no names. That was cigarette number six. This waiting is insufferable. All right, so that was the girl that called her Annabeth or Annabelle or whatever it was. Something with Anna. Uh, so that's going to be kind of important. So let's get going again. Let's check that corpse right there. You don't hear that very often, do you? Let me just check that corpse. So yeah, the uh, impact on the choice on whether or not to draw your gun will have no impact. Elizabeth will have the same exact dialogue as you'll see, which... It'll sort of not make sense if you don't draw your gun on him, if that makes any sense, but... You'll see what I'm talking about in a second. Now I'm probably going to infuse my shields. I already did, uh, health and salt, nice. so I'm going to infuse my shield right now. Because they're all really important. Uh, shield, you know, I don't need to explain that. It makes perfect sense. The shield is rechargeable, though, so it's maybe a little bit better to infuse than the health. Although, what the health does, it, uh, it's like, it infuses more, if that makes any sense. Like, if you use the infusion, it's gonna have more total effect, while it'll have a lot less, like, on the shield. But the shield recharges, so it's important to get, like, both of them. Make sure you infuse all of them. Don't just overpower one. So, there should be something down here, if I remember correctly. Oh, there's a Vox phone. As the months and years turned to memories, and money. so did the men of Congress turn to righteousness. And through the technology of men, the dollars of Washington, the Lord worked his will upon Columbia and raised her high above the Sodom below. So yeah, it's talking about how the U.S. government funded Columbia, like at its birth. All right, so I gotta follow Lizbeth. Just stay where you are. Get away from me. Hey, come back here. You see, they attacked us first. Now, when you draw the pistol, that would sort of make sense that, like, you initiated the fight. But no, they attacked us first. So I don't get why she's angry. You think people like that are just going to let you walk away? You are an investment. And you will not be safe until you are far away from here. What do they want from me? I don't know. 
That's the last time anyone gets the drop on me. Here's another kind of cool thing. Um, <laughs> you'll see. You see how its hand is, his hand is just like stabbed. She'll wrap it up. Let me see your hand. Using like part of her skirt, I think. Like part of her clothing. And your hand will be wrapped the entire it's not game. The last of it, is it? I don't know. There. So it'll stay like that the whole game. Which I thought, eh. You know, I guess it wasn't that hard to do, probably, but it's one of those, like, neat little details that I really like. Alright, guys, I'm going to leave it off right here. I do hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it. Remember, follow me on Twitter. That's probably the easiest way to stay in contact with me. Like, favorite, subscribe if you did enjoy. That's much appreciated. No, seriously, please like. It helps so much. Uh, you know what? Don't even just like, you know, rate it. If you dislike this video, dislike it. If you liked it, like it. I want to get, you know, feedback so I know what to do differently in other videos. But uh, just follow me on Twitter, probably the best way. Again, I said that already. <laughs> All right. As always, guys, st <laughs> I love you guys.